What if I told you that the secret to success lies not in talent or IQ, but in two simple traits? Stay tuned, find out what they are and how you can master them. Have you ever wondered what separates those who achieve great success from those who don't? It's a question that has puzzled many. You see, success isn't solely about having a high IQ or being the most talented. There's something more profound at play here. It's about having the courage and resilience to overcome obstacles in one's path. Imagine it like this. Life is a journey with a road filled with bumps, twists and turns. The ones who reach their destination aren't necessarily the fastest or the smartest. They are the ones who keep going, who pick themselves up after a fall, who don't let a detour stop them from moving forward. Enter Dr. Peter McCullough, a renowned expert in the field of personal development. He argues that the secret to success lies not in our brains or our abilities, but in our hearts, our spirits. The key to achieving great success lies in our ability to build courage and resilience. Before we delve deeper, we'd like to remind you how important your support is for us. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. Each like, each share and each subscription helps us reach more people, create more content and continue our mission to unlock the secrets of success. So if you're learning and growing with us, consider supporting us. It's a small act, but it makes a big difference. Remember, we're in this journey together, and your support helps us create more content like this. Now let's dive back into the heart of the matter and learn to build courage with Dr. Peter McCullough. Dr. Peter McCullough, an expert in the field, has a step-by-step -step guide to building courage. Dr. McCullough's approach begins with the notion that the first step to courage is facing your fears. It's not about eliminating fear, but acknowledging it, understanding it, and choosing to act despite it. Imagine standing at the edge of a high diving board, your heart pounding. The fear is real, but so is the decision to jump. That's courage. The second step is setting achievable goals. Goals give you a path, a direction to channel your courage. Instead of a vague idea of wanting to be brave, you have a tangible target. Maybe it's speaking up in a meeting or asking someone out on a date. These are small, achievable goals that require courage, but they're not insurmountable. They're not climbing Everest, but they might feel like it. And that's okay. The point is to start small, and with each success, your courage grows. The third step is practicing self-affirmations. Sounds a bit new agey, right? But it's backed by science. Dr. McCullough suggests that positive affirmations can help you overcome self-doubt, improve your self-esteem and foster courage. So it's not just about telling yourself you're brave, it's about believing it. It's about standing in front of the mirror, looking yourself in the eye and saying, I am courageous, I can do this. The more you say it, the more you believe it. The more you believe it, the braver you become. And finally, courage is like a muscle. The more you use it, the stronger it gets. So. Don't expect to become fearless overnight. It's a process, a journey. Each step you take, each fear you face, each goal you achieve, and each affirmation you believe adds a brick to your fortress of courage. By following these steps, you're not only building courage, but you're setting a strong foundation to overcome obstacles. So take that first step today. Face your fear, set a goal, practice self-affirmation, and remember, courage is not the absence of fear, it's the triumph over it. Now that we've covered building courage, let's move on to resilience. Again, Dr. McCullough has a guide for this. Resilience, as Dr. McCullough explains, is not just about withstanding life's storms, but learning to dance in the rain. It's about developing a positive mindset, a crucial tool in your resilience toolkit. Start by reframing the way you perceive challenges. Instead of seeing them as insurmountable obstacles, view them as opportunities for growth and learning. Now, this shift won't happen overnight. It's a gradual process, like strengthening a muscle. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day. Then let's talk about learning from failures. Dr. McCullough emphasizes that failure is not the opposite of success, but a stepping stone towards it. So when you stumble, don't wallow in self-pity. Instead, take a step back, evaluate what went wrong, and identify what you can do better next time. Think of Thomas Edison, who once said, I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. Now that's resilience in action. Finally, maintaining a support system is key to building resilience. Surround yourself with people who uplift you, challenge you, and believe in you. They're your cheerleaders, your sounding board, your safety net. 
They are the ones who remind you of your strength when you're feeling weak, who push you to keep going when you feel like giving up. They're the ones who remind you that you're not alone in this journey. In practical terms, this could mean reaching out to a trusted friend when you're feeling overwhelmed or joining a community of like-minded individuals who share your goals and aspirations. It could also mean seeking professional help like a mentor or a life coach who can provide guidance and support. In summary, building resilience involves developing a positive mindset, learning from failures and maintaining a support system. Each of these steps is an essential part of the journey towards resilience and ultimately success. With resilience, you're preparing yourself to bounce back from any setbacks you might face on your journey to success. You've now learned the steps to build courage and resilience, but why are these traits so important? The answer lies in the nature of success itself. Success isn't a straight path. It's a winding road filled with detours and roadblocks. It's about the ability to face the unknown, to weather the storm, and to keep going no matter what. Think about the great innovators of our time, like Elon Musk or J.K. Rowling. They didn't achieve their massive success by avoiding challenges. No, they faced them head on, armed with courage and resilience. Courage gave them the strength to take risks, to step out of their comfort zone, and to pursue their dreams despite the fear of failure. Resilience, on the other hand, provided them the grit to bounce back from setbacks, to learn from their mistakes, and to keep moving forward. Remember, courage and resilience are the keys to overcoming obstacles and achieving great success. As we wrap up, let's take a moment to recap what we've learned today. We embarked on a journey into the world of courage and resilience, guided by the wisdom of Dr. Peter McCullough. We've discovered the transformative power of questions and how they can lead us towards greater self-awareness and growth. We then delved into the steps to build courage and learned that it's not about being fearless, but about facing and conquering those fears. We've also explored the importance of resilience, that innate ability to bounce back from setbacks and keep pushing forward. Remember, courage and resilience are not just admirable qualities, but essential tools for achieving success. They empower us to overcome obstacles, conquer self-doubt, and keep our eyes on the prize no matter what. Keep these steps in mind as you navigate your own journey to success. Remember, it's not about how many times you fall, but how many times you get back up. Thank you for joining us today, and may you find the courage and resilience within you to achieve your dreams. Before we say goodbye, we have a small request. If you found this video helpful, we encourage you to take action. Start by liking this video to let us know that our content is useful to you. Next, share it with your friends, family, or anyone who you think could benefit from this information. It's a small act, but it can make a big difference in someone's life. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. By doing so, you'll receive notifications about our upcoming content, ensuring you never miss a chance to learn and grow. Remember, success is within your reach. All it takes is a little courage and resilience. So don't hesitate to take this journey towards self-improvement and personal growth. Thank you for being a part of this journey with us. We can't wait to see where your courage and resilience will take you. Until next time, keep asking questions, keep building your courage, and never stop bouncing back. Your journey to success starts here and we're excited to be a part of it.